and welcome. Today we are going to continue with our number poem. So let's go through what we've done so far. <clears throat> One straight staff on the road to take. Two Egyptian geese swimming in the lake. Three black swifts swooping through the sky. Four sailing boats sailing slowly by. Five seahorses floating on a wave. Six seashells in a sandy cave. So let's go on to the next part of our poem. Just find a nice clean page. Seven flapping flags flying in the breeze. Eight wood owls sitting in the trees. Nine pink petunias nodding in the sun. Okay, let's get drawing. So I will begin with my spring green, my bright green, to make a couple of hills. So I'm using my, my papa bear. Baby bear, mama bear, papa bear. So I come from the side and go down. And then from here, I go up. And you can see we have two hills. So we'll just push down really gently to color those hills in. <clears throat> okay, after we have our hills, we want to add some trees. So I will just find my, <clears throat> my brown. Okay, so I have my brown crayon. And I'm going to do a tree here and also here. So starting from the bottom, going up with Mama Bear, we push up. We don't want to go too high because we want to see some branches. So from the bottom and up again. And we can do that. So we have our trunk, and then we want some branches. So I come from the bottom up and go out, and the same here, and then I'll do some smaller branches coming off. And then we want to have just one branch coming out, nice big branch coming out here. And we'll do the same on the other side. So here, bring it down, going up, down to up. Just how the tree grows. And then the branches, this way, this way, this way. And the other branch is going to come over next to this one, look. So they're right next to each other and they're the same, same height. can do some smaller branches coming off. So we have our tree. Now I want to put some leaves on the tree, but um, instead of having green leaves, because fall is here at the moment where, where I live, I'm going to do some fall colored leaves. So I have a nice red, an orange, a golden yellow, and a brown. So I'll just go to each branch and I'm just doing some oval shapes as I go through the branches. I'm going to just do branches on the bottom because I want to put something on top there so I won't go on top. So just a few branches because in the fall the leaves come off, don't they? Sorry, just a few leaves because in the fall the leaves fall off. So we don't need to have the branches full of leaves, just some. <clears throat> and then over here to the other tree that we have. Okay, and um, moving on to lovely golden yellow with some more golden yellow leaves 
along the branches. And down and up, all along. And the last colour I will use is brown. A few brown leaves. We usually do see a few brown leaves on the four trees. can even do a few on the ground, not too many because we also want to draw some things on the ground. Okay, so I have my trees. Now let's listen to that part of the poem. Seven flapping flags flying in the breeze. Eight wood owls sitting in the trees. Nine pink petunias nodding in the sun. Okay, so here we're going to draw some flags. So for my flags, I'm going to do purple flags. So I have this, oh, hold on. I have this purple. And I also have, for the flagpole, I am going to use a red. Okay, so we want seven flagpoles, and <clears throat> excuse me, in the in the fall where I live, some days it can be very windy, and this is a windy day. So the flags, the poles are going slightly this way, so the wind is blowing. So the flagpoles are bending. So we have one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. And then, so we have the poles, and now we want some flags. Okay, so out, in a little, out a little, and across. And that's what our flag for looks like. See, I'm doing that same shape on each one, and then I'm just going to colour them in that lovely purple. <coughs> so we have our seven flapping flags flying in the breeze. Eight wood owls sitting in the trees. So look what, I, <clears throat> look what I'm going to do for the wood owls. So I'm going to do an oval very gently and then a head. A circle for the head. Now I want to fit eight owls. That's a lot of owls. So keep that in mind when you're drawing. So a nice big round, uh, oh, and big, a nice big oval body and then we have that round head. So we want to try and get four on this one. And then another four on this one. So let's see, how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five. Do some detail. So just doing that for the wings. So just doing a curved line coming down. So the wings are coming in looks round and down. Round and down. And you can get a dark crayon. Uh, 
and some owls have these kind of little tufty things, don't they? Like where their ears are. So we can do these little tufts. <clears throat> and also little pointy bits coming out the bottom. See where they're, they're sat on the tree and they have that little pointy tail feathers coming down. And then we can finish off with their beaks. So I'm just using my, my orange stick crayon just to do some little triangle beaks. So we have eight wood owls. in the trees and then nine pink petunias nodding in the sun so let's do some petunias so petunias are a type of flower I'm going to first do the, the stem okay so have a look I'm going to start over here I want to put in nine so I'm going to start over this side about here and then I'm going to curve up okay one Slight curve around three, four, five. Let's put little flowers on there. Six, seven, eight, ten more, nine. In my set of crayons, I don't have pink. So what I'll do instead is use red, but very gently. And I'm going to put a flower on this side because they are nodding in the sun and there's a gentle breeze that sets it. So let's just very gently do some little lines coming from that yellow center that I did. And Another one, I'll do the yellow center and then go, just go out from that center with little lines. This one is especially moving in the breeze, so going out. Those lovely petals. This is number six. Okay, I'm just going to get my green crayon and I'm going to come back to my meadow, my hills with my papa bear and just gently add some darker green. And the same on this side, just coming down, adding a bit more green. Okay, and I'll just finish with some sky. So here's my blue block crayon and my papa bear. I can just go over the picture.
very gently. So there we have our seven flapping flags flying in the breeze. Eight wood owls sitting in the trees. Nine pink petunias nodding in the sun. See you next time. Bye-bye.